Wrap up a hard day by sitting in the hot tub or maybe even walking on a nearby trail. Lori has found another dream home this morning. She joins us live with from Orangevale with more. Yes, yeah, so you guys saw the inside. You saw out front. It's like a big park out there. Yeah. Well, now we are in the backyard, and it is an oasis. And there is a wiffle ball field on the back side of this. It. So we're going to get there. I just got off the phone with my special guest, uh -huh. and he's almost here. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, I have Mandy and Brandon Shepard with the Residence Real Estate Group to take us on a tour of this beautiful yard. Uh, one more time, Mandy, the price tag for Cody. Dun, da, da, da. That's for you, Cody. One million five hundred ninety-five thousand. Okay, so square footage on this house. One more time. So it's forty-one hundred plus the three hundred square foot sunroom addition, making it really closer to about forty-five hundred square feet. Okay, so that's all the indoor business. But then you come out back, and this is beautiful. Absolutely, like you said, Laura, you got your own backyard oasis here. Uh, beautiful built-in pool, newer Pebble Tech, been resurfaced. Uh, you got uh, outdoor fireplace, little creek bed over here, gazebo, and then obviously the wiffle ball field, which has been a lot of fun for the community. They've had a lot of big wiffle ball games and get togethers. It's always the focal point of the backyard. Okay, so let's go for a little walk. Now I'm looking at all the flags, and of course I'm with Scott Holcomb this morning. So right away he noticed there's no Dodgers flag. So you can always put up whatever flag you want. You know, you can do what you want once you get here. Uh, out back over the fence, there also no one behind you, which is always nice. So there's Look just a lot of land out back behind this spot. That's right. So this parcel's uh, just shy of two acres. And then behind you, you just have an open field. Uh, nothing really planned back there. So, so privacy galore. There's also room for a, a, there's a pad over here. So if someone wanted to build a guest quarters, granny quarters, you have actually a driveway that goes back there. So plenty of room for really whatever you'd like to put out here. This is so cool. Okay, we're going to keep walking this way. I'm going to let the guys hang out over here for a second while we kind of turn this corner okay. because this continues all the way around, takes you back uh, by this little gazebo court, little water feature, Love. and then you also have the hot tub right over there. Correct. So uh, as Brandon right mentioned, the there's a special little area back here where you could potentially... <laughs> oh my God. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Right. Scott oh, is oh, like hot. seven years old right now. Third. So you just got to let him do his thing. Go home. Let go him do his go thing. Home. Go home. <laughs> If he slides, yes. Five. Yes. 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 Two, two, once again, it's the height thing. Too tall to try sliding with the camera and all that. So nice great. job, God. Okay, all so right. right over here is where we have the hot tub and the water feature. Correct. And there's tons of fruit and citrus trees going on over here. Oh, a little apple orchard. Um, and then as Brandon had mentioned, there is this pad over here where they have... A lot of electrical ran and the possibility for what could have been maybe like a casita or guest quarters or a great spot for another sports court. Yeah, and if you missed us last hour, we talked a little bit about this neighborhood, Brandon. Just one more time, kind of the, the privacy and the uniqueness of, of living here in this spot in Orangevale. That's right. Woodbridge Ranch, I mean, that's really a critical point in this whole uh, sale of this home is people getting able to experience the joys of Woodbridge. It just brings so much to, to the table with regards to community. And okay, Brandon. Go ahead. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Turn the camera this way, Scott. We got to hide our special guest until he starts oh, oh, running okay, the bases. Okay, okay. 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 He's got to run the bases. We got to see him running the bases. Okay. okay. <laughs> He's in awe. He can't run the bases. He run the bases. Who is it? <laughs> Who's the special guest? It's, it's the left grass off. Hey. We're out. I could not be on the field without my boy Dave. Yay! Hey. <laughs> Him and Scott are living their best childhood slide, life right slide. now. They, they want me to leave them here. Yeah, enough about Woodbridge, right? We got a guy running the bases here. But yeah, no, it, during the holidays, they also do a lot of fun stuff around here. During Christmas, they do a Santa parade. Um, Halloween, they do a lot of, it's just really community driven. So uh, if, you, if you want a great place to raise a family, bring your family, Woodbridge Ranch is really where you want to be. I mean, and I think this wiffle ball field is really where you want to be. Grass, what do you think? Oh, my God. This is awesome. Where's the ball and the bat? I know. We're going to work on that. We're going to get you set up. Awesome. We're going to get you set up. I didn't know if you were going to make it. It's really great. But you did. He made it. He the baseball so guys. Excited. That's who I'm with today. Right. Yes, you are. You were so excited. And with the two Dodger fans, too. They're very, very excited. I'm the with the two them. Dodger fans. The tallest on our roster. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Look at Yay, him checking the place out. I know. He's like looking around, calling his <laughs> so shot. Funny. So funny. The two of them are over the moon right now. <laughs> Hilarious.
Lori, I think you're going to yes. be there for the Residence rest of the day. Residence Real Estate Group, you guys, you can find them online. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know what? I'm going to be. I'm going to be. That's, yeah. that's for sure with these two. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there he goes. I did, think uh, <laughs> did Dave drive that little red wagon there? Is that what took him so long? Well, you know, he <laughs> does go under the speed limit. He was driving grass off speed. <laughs> <laughs> so great. Oh, oh, man. Get here. Thanks, Lori.